I'm gonna win today. No, I will. I won! Yahoo! Huh. Well done, Thomas. <laughs> I went all the way back to Tenmouth. Well done, both of you. James, you are to unload barges here at the docks. Oh gosh, I like that job. And a special goes to the winner, Thomas. Oh, hooray! Oh. Oh. Oh my goodness, I can't handle this. I just had to get it together. Just go in there and ask. This is your friendship festival for Sonor Day. <sighs> All this rests in your hooves. Oh. Hello, Twilight. I got all your assignments here. Thank goodness you're here, Spike. I'm just so nervous about this meeting. Why? What are you talking about? I'm about to ask the royal princesses of Equestria a very huge favor. What if they reject me? It'll be fine. Just remember the most important thing. 
You are a princess too. I guess you're right. Of course I'm right. You'll see, it's gonna be fine. Hello, royal princesses. Thank you all for seeing me. I have an idea that I'll make the sort of celebration that everyone has ever seen. Yes, Twilight, we are very excited. All the ponies and people are arriving all morning. I'm guessing that the mayor of Sodor might be a bigger attraction. Yes, he is the main event. After all that, I can use your help, Spike. And based on my precise calculation, to get the very best lighting for the stage, Princess Celestia, I was hoping you could make sure the sun stays about 28.1 degrees to the south. And Princess Luna, if you could raise the moon 62 degrees to the north at the same time, it would reflect the sunlight on the other side and really frame the entire stage perfectly. Wait, so you want us to move the sun and the moon for the party? Well, I'm sorry to say, I don't have your magic. Twilight, each of us uses our powers to serve Equestria in our own way. You are the princess of friendship. You already have all the magic you need. So, will that be a no? Okay, Thomas, I love that crayon on your flatbed. Thanks, Cranky. Now I must get going. On, 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 fast, fast, faster. Yoo-hoo! Wee! Oh no! Help! Help! I can't stop! No, 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 no! Ouch! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Oh! oh. That was close! But where am I? I don't even know where I am. Ouch. Woo! Silly looking trees. <gasps> Whoa! Bubbling boilers. What a funny place to have a building like that. I wonder what else I can find. Fizzling fireboxes. This is a big building. I gotta go tell the others. Someone must hear me. Hello? Hello? That's Birdie. What is it, Thomas? I heard your whistle. Birdie, I just discovered a hidden building. It's hidden trees. No way. Tell everyone. Oh, I will. 
Hey, Harold! Harold! Thomas has discovered a hidden building! Tell everyone! Oh, I will. Okay, sky is cleared and ready for the festival. <gasps> a one, a two, a one, two, three. Do 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 Wow, Rarity, that was a fine job you're doing there. Well, of course, it won't get it done until after the concert. Don't worry, Applejack. Fabulous takes time. Okay, I just need a few calculations and then we're ready. Hey, Twilight. Hello, Spiky Wiky. Hey, Rarity. How about the other princesses? Do they like your idea? <sighs> Not exactly. They think they can make today perfect without their magic. And they were absolutely right, darling. This festival is your idea, and we know you're up to the task. What if I'm not? What if the mayor of Sora hates the festival? If I fail the festival, then who am I? Twilight, listen to me. You cannot fail. You are the princess of friendship. You have us, so stop worrying, okay? It's time to show them what you've got It's time to go and get things done But you don't have to do it on your own Cause you've got friends right here to make it fun We got this You got this We got this together You got this. We got this together. Today needs to be perfect. It all comes down to me. I don't know if I'm ready for all the things they need me to be. I am the princess of friendship, but that is more than just a crown. It's a promise to bring ponies together.
looking for the pony in charge. Hello, Mr. Mayor. I'm Princess Twilight Sparkle. Hello, Princess Twilight. It's nice to meet you. Ponies of Equestria! Thomas has discovered a hidden building! Ooh, a building! Take me to Sir Tom Hat and Thomas at once. Here it is, Princess Celestia and Sir Tom Hat. Thomas, you have made a wonderful discovery. This is the City Museum. The City Museum? Wow, I heard stories about the City Museum. When engines first came to Sodor, this is the main museum. This is called the City Museum. How come no one goes here now? Everyone and every pony came to look at different museums. Everyone and every pony think that the City Museum is going to be lost forever. But now it is found. And it is all thanks to you, Thomas. And this will be the perfect place for our friendship festival. Agreed. Let's go tell the others. We are very proud of you, Thomas. Yeah, we're so proud. The city museum must be restored in time for Sodor Day. That's right. The restoration will be a lot of work. Uh, what's a restoration? A restoration means you make something very old look new again. Now all of you needs to get to work on the city museum. The city museum must be ready in time for Sodor Day.
Thomas, you are to find lost and hidden tracks around the museum. Alright. And since you discovered the city museum, we're giving you the most important job of all. That's right. We're leaving you in charge of all the work. Fizzling fireboxes. We are bringing another engine from the mainland to do your usual jobs. Oh, I can't wait for this. I'm being in charge of the city museum. Oh, this is so exciting. Wow, that's the new engine? He's a similar shape to Thomas. Everyone, meet Sebastian. He's a similar shape to Thomas, same strength and same size. Welcome to Sodor, Sebastian. You're going to be a lot here. Hello, everyone, and nice to meet you, too. Oh, my. We got ourselves a Thomas clone here. Oh, what did Thomas say? <laughs> Look how the sea museum is coming along. While I'm in charge, I won't have time to come back to Timoth. It looks pretty good, Thomas. Oh, I forgot to tell you. The new engine has come to Sodor. He's very friendly, and everyone likes him. His name is Sebastian. He's doing your jobs very well. Was well, that so? Huh. Huh? That must be Sebastian. <laughs> Please pour on more bubbles. <laughs> this was fun. Huh? Where is Annie and Clarabelle? But those are my coaches. Huh. Huh? <laughs> Your jokes are very funny. <laughs> We're glad to have you around, Sugar Cube. Oh, that was nothing. Calm down, Thomas. You're not being replaced. Oh my gosh! Oh, hello there. You must be Thomas. <gasps> hey! You're an E2 just like me. <laughs> Maybe we could be E2 buddies. Hello, Thomas. Duh! I had to get back to the city museum. I have work to do. Well, 
What's his problem? I think he's jealous of you, Sebastian. Oh, nonsense. We wouldn't replace Thomas, would we? They're trying to replace me. I'll show them I'm better than Sebastian. I will. Now I need you to work harder than ever before, okay? Okay, Thomas, whatever you say, you're the boss. Oh, I like being in charge. Wait, what? No, 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 no! Da Oh, come on, you gotta be kidding me! Oh no. How the heck did this happen, Thomas? Oh. I don't want to talk about it. Thomas, you must go to the works to be repaired. But I want to stay in charge, sir. Sebastian will take your place in charge of the city museum. Bad luck, Thomas. But I found the city museum. I'll be back. I'll be in charge again. Okay, Thomas, you're all fixed. Okay, now I can get back to my job at the city museum. Hello, Percy. I thought Toby used to pick up the workmen. Hello, Thomas. Sebastian chose me to pick up the workmen because I give very smooth rides. And Sebastian chose me to do some cooking for the cakes and pies because I'm a very good chef cooker. What? But, but, but I... <sighs> I don't want to hear about Sebastian. Wow! Come on, driver. Let's make Sebastian proud. The city museum looks as good as new. This is very exciting. Thomas, come here. Oh, hello, Thomas. Hello, Thomas. Sebastian is doing a good job. Work is moving fast. That's right. So Tom Hatt and me decided that Sebastian will stay in charge and you will help him. What? Oh. Okay, Thomas, I'd like you to shunt some freight cars for me. You're the best shunter ever, Thomas. I'll be back with the freight cars in a half hour. Make sure you do a good job, Thomas. Sebastian will have to take them up the hill. If I shot a heavy load of some freight cars, Sebastian won't be able to pull them, and no one will think he's strong anymore, and I will be in charge again. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man, this freight car is heavier than I thought. Yeah. There you go, it's ready. And now for the brake van.
Okay, Spastian's train is ready to go. Here he comes. <laughs> oh my. That is a heavy train. Not for a strong engine like you. This is heavy. Oh, I can't do it. Oh, no, bust my buffers. Cinders and ashes! Oh crud. Glad it didn't hit me. Oh no. What have I done? This was a disaster! Thomas! Why did you have to shut that heavy load for Sebastian? But... I... I... We're going to have to clean up this mess at once! Thomas didn't like Sebastian. That's why he should have did that heavy load for him. Why would Thomas do such a thing like that? He would never do that. Would he? other engines don't want me around anymore. <sighs> Thomas feels so alone. I feel sorry for him. Now listen up. The city museum may not be ready for Sodor Day. We're going to have to clean up that mess over there. That means extra work for all of you. And as for you, Thomas, you get to sit in the sign for the rest of the day. Thomas, I don't know how to assess you more, that you'd rather really be trying to sell out Sebastian, or you thought that, that this attempt will work. You let your jealousy get the best of you, Thomas. I'm truly disappointed. This is not the Thomas that I know and love. Yeah, not cool, dude. Come on, let's get out of here. Twilight hates me. And so do the other engines and ponies and the forest animals. Feeling cold, tired, lonely. Couldn't tonight get any worse. <sighs> I'll huff and jump all through the night Till I'm far away and free and when my steam runs out, I'll know that no one will find me. But things are not the same as before. Mistakes I make, no one can ignore. I keep my pain to work looking fine. I try so hard to be on time, but I'm not a useful engine anymore. I'm not a useful engine anymore. 
Hmm, I wonder where this track goes. Hello? Hello? Hmm. What a funny place to have a mine. Huh. I don't even know where I am. Whoa! Yahoo! This ride is so much fun. I never want to come home. We. Cinders and ashes! This track is flooded! Oh, this mine doesn't feel fun anymore. It felt scary. No one will find me now. No one will want to find me. Where's Thomas? Um, I don't know. Hey, Terrence, have you seen Thomas? Uh, no, I haven't seen Thomas anywhere. Hey, Birdie, have you seen Thomas? No, I haven't seen Thomas either. Whoa. Bust my buffers. Whoa. Has any of you seen Thomas? No, Twilight, I haven't seen Thomas. I haven't seen Thomas either, Twilight. Sir, Princess Celestia, Thomas has disappeared. Nobody knows where he is. And I miss him. This is very strange. Yeah, I agree. We must find Thomas. You're right, Toby. This is a state of emergency. Everyone must look for Thomas. Yeah. 
Sir, but there was no sign of Thomas anywhere. <sighs> Sir, Princess Celestia, we must find Thomas. He found the city museum. It's his museum. I agree with you, Percy. Me too. You're quite right, Percy. We must find Thomas. Excuse me, but is it Thomas that you're looking for? Uh, yeah, why? I was going to tell his story about his heroic actions to save the Princess of Friendship Twilight Sparkle from the criminals. Oh, is that so? Yes, indeed. Oh, I just hope we can find Thomas. He saved my life from the criminals. Yeah, especially Lola DeVille. We can't let the opening without him. <sighs> I know how important Thomas was. Whoa! Whoa! I don't like this! Whoa! I know why he run away. But those are my coaches. <sighs> Calm down, Thomas. You're not being replaced. Oh my gosh! Thomas isn't a bad engine. He's a sad engine. I wonder if, if he's run away because he thinks no one likes him anymore. Maybe Thomas is hiding above the hidden hills. I'll look from there. I must tell him we all miss him. I'm also going to tell him that the storyteller has come to town. But I'm going to need help. Twilight, I'm going to need your help to find Thomas. He's hiding above the hidden hills. Okay, take me to him. I must talk to him. Okay, let's go to the hills. Whoa, 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 whoa. My boiler is cold. Ugh. Oh no, he's not here either. Where is he? It's alright, Twilight. We'll find him. Whoa. Whoa! Oh no, 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 Whoa! Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! 
Woo! What a ride! But how am I going to get onto it? Oh well, might as well stay here for a while. We can't find Thomas anywhere. We're not giving up. Keep looking. Thomas, where are you? I wish I hadn't made Sebastian and Paul those freight cars. I did not like him doing my jobs. Now look where I am. I'm a very silly engine. <sighs> I miss Twilight and the gang and my friends. Well, she doesn't love me anymore. I deserve to be stuck here for the rest of my life. I'm sorry, Twilight. Thomas is nowhere to be found. Oh, Thomas, where are you? Hey, that must be Twilight Sparkle. She must be looking for me. I got to let her know where I am. <coughs> hey, is that? It must be. Turn to the old track, Sebastian. Thomas, is that you? There you are, Thomas. We found you at last. Spastian? Twilight? You've been looking for me? Oh, yes. We were so worried about you. And so was I. What the blue thing are you doing down there? And why did you run away? Well, I got jealous of Sebastian because he's better than me. And I thought you didn't need me anymore. And you didn't love me anymore. So I don't deserve to be so Tom had number one anymore. Thomas, I know I was disappointed, but you are my number one engine and friend. And you always will be. You see, Sebastian still needs to learn about this railway. He needs to take over your place while you're in charge, not to replace you. No one could ever replace you, Thomas. Not even you're being a jealous numbskull. Oh, really? Wow. I'm sorry, Twilight. I shouldn't have been so jealous. I'm sorry too, Thomas. I shouldn't have been more sensitive. And I have something to tell you. The storyteller just come into town. And she's going to tell your story about your heroic actions to save Princess Twilight Sparkle from the criminals. Especially Laura DeVille. Wow, really? This is exciting! Of course it is, Thomas. Why wouldn't it? Sebastian, I'm sorry I was horrible to you. I was wrong. I was silly to be cross that you were in charge. I wanted to be your friend. Thomas, we will be friends. What do you say? Eat two buddies? E2 Buddies. That's what I like to hear. And I'll have you back on the track in no time at all. <laughs> Here we go, Thomas. Eh.
Wow, wow. I can do it. Hooray! Oh no, what was that? I burst my safety valve by pulling you. Dang it. <sighs> Don't worry, Sebastian. It's my turn to help you. I'll shunt you home. Really? Thank you, Thomas. Here we go, Sebastian. Don't worry, Sebastian. Thomas and I will shunt you home in no time at all. <gasps> Twilight and Sebastian found Thomas! Hooray! My best friend is back forever! Welcome home, Thomas! <laughs> Can I? Lead the way, number one! <laughs> How can I ever be one more important than any of them? Right on time, Thomas and Sebastian. Well done, both of you. Now the City Museum is ready in time for the Sodor Day. Please, sir. Can Sebastian bring the mayor to the opening? But that is your job, Thomas. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Sure then sure. Okay, then. I'll telephone the mayor straight away. Hey, Thomas. Would you mind writing to Princess Celestia and tell her what you learned? Well, I'll be happy to, Twilight. Hey, Spike. Would you get the note for me? I'm ready. Dear Princess Celestia, this is Thomas the Tang Engine writing to you about my adventures. This month, I learned that being jealous and telling lies gets you nowhere in friendship. I also learned that there is plenty of love for every friend to share. So for now on, when I judge someone new, I get the chance to get to know them better. And they might even become a good friend. Well, I'm proud of you, Thomas. I guess you learned a Fabio lesson about jealousy. I have, Twilight. I have. The City Museum is no longer lost. Welcome to the City Museum of Sodor. Now, let me begin Thomas' story about his heroic actions to save Princess Twilight Sparkle from the criminals. I'm Dr. Mal Fidget, and Thomas is the most heroic engine I've ever met. Way to go, Thomas! Wow!
That was one amazing story. Yeah, it happened three years ago. I think you should be the leader of the track. After all, you are number one. Uh, Sebastian, we will all be the leaders of the track. It's Thomas the Tank Engine, hip 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 hooray! Chug 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 chug, he rides all on the way. And when you hear that whistle, it can only be one train. Our favorite little engine, Thomas is his name. Thomas the Tank Engine, rolling along. All of his friends will be coming along. Thomas, we love you. He's a really useful engine with a heart that's big and strong. He chug a chug chug just working hard, helping everyone. Thomas, he has lots of friends and you can be one too. Just clap, clap, clap and sing along. Thomas, we love you. Twilight, Rainbow Dash, and Fluttershy. Spike, Applejack, and Rarity. Don't forget Pinkie Pie. He's always up to mischief, the cheeky little train. He jumps, 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 jumps everywhere. He's always playing games. The fat controller's got him, but loves him just the same. The favorite little engine, Thomas is his name. Thomas the Tank Engine. Gauge, 
where small and strong is all the rage To handle Rusty, Mighty Mac, Whoa. Fearless Freddy at the back Reneas and then Peter Sam, Scarlowy, Duncan, he's my man Whoa. With Mr. Percival in charge, no work's too hard, no job's too large Yeah, uh, uh. Top him high, he keeps an eye on every engine passing by. 